saw to complete the lineup. All set to go and sprinting away from the 1,000-metre marker. Nice start for them over here. Let's see where they go. Well, Roll With The Punches has decided to go to the inner of the track here. So that's Roll With The Punches right down the inside, down the centre. Long Sword and Smith and & Wesson. And towards the outside, Karangatang leads with Kinchin Shah ahead of Tchaikovsky. So they've used the entire width of the track with 600 metres left to go. And Roll With The Punches, the leader, right down the inside. Karangatang's on the outside and Long Sword between them. Then Kinchin Shah. That's followed further back in the field by Smith and & Wesson and Tchaikovsky. The runners work their way down to the last 350 metres and Karangatang, the leader on the outside. Then comes Kinshin Shah, right down the inside is Roll With The Punches. Long Sword is trying to get into it. 200 metres left to go. It's Karangatang, right down the inside, Roll With The Punches. Tchaikovsky is running on with Long Sword and Kinshin Shah. Anyone's call. Running home strongly is Tchaikovsky at Roll With The Punches. Tchaikovsky, Roll With The Punches, maybe. Roll With The Punches. Punches from Tchaikovsky, it's close. Then off the field. That's the running of race number six with one more to go. Sorry, Nico did actually uh, echo the sentiment uh, would head the uh, late James Murapiri's uh, old adage, the smaller the field, the bigger the upset to come to fruition in race six, and it certainly has. It is by far the biggest outsider who's come through to win, and that is much travel Tchaikovsky. Tchaikovsky is welcome back well it is the big upset of the afternoon and uh, the second biggest upset of the afternoon have one thing in common jared penny but we'll be talking about him in a while but let's uh, congratulate shepherd it's been a while since this horse won but uh, certainly won very well yeah and uh, thanks uh, for winning thank uh -huh. you for us thank you for my owners uh-huh thank you and so good morning everyone i will be my guys we are pose no. Uh, we'll like us. So. All right. All right. So the guys are coming in, but it is a Tchaikovsky now. As far as the stats go, it'll be win number five from a 30 outings. And that certainly has been a memorable afternoon for the gentleman on my right. I was saying the two biggest outsiders on the afternoon have one thing in common, and it is Jared Penny. No, thank you, sir. Yes, yeah. Um, I haven't ridden a double for a while, so it feels very good. Yeah, a memorable one as well. Oh, without a doubt. So, um, yeah, just back to this also. So his form is not so bad. Um, you know, his first run was very good. Uh, his second run in the sprint, uh, he had the fastest 400 finish. He was flying, and uh, he jumped badly. It was a bit of my fault. So, you know, I must just say thank you to Mr. Roo uh, for giving me the opportunity and trying one more time on the horse, and I'm glad I could get it home for him. As I say, you are a man who deserves all the chances that uh, come your way. No, thanks very much. I appreciate the kind words. And yeah, just for all the support, all the trainers that are helping me, thank you so much. And again, to Mr. Rubik, thank you to him. May it grow and long may it continue. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you so, so much. Now, let's talk to the man himself. The horses have been knocking on the door, it must be said. We've been waxing lyrical about your horses for so long, and uh, maybe this is the turning point. Yeah, it, you waxing them and things like that. The prices drops, and that's not good for me. <laughs> well, you can't win. You know what, you're damned if you do and you're damned if you don't. <laughs> yeah, Cecil, thank you. And thank you for the support and kind words about my horses. I really appreciate it. Uh, Jared made a cock-up uh, two starts ago with, with Tchaikovsky. And, um, you know, I think any other jock, I would have not put him on again. But uh, he's doing a lot of work um, come Friday, Friday mornings. Always here when I ask him. Congratulations. I think he did a very, very good job. Well, to your loyal uh, patrons like Mr. Myberg, we wish them well. And, of course, uh, this one, let's uh, call it the turning point. Yeah, I think the whole gang is going to be super drunk tonight. And uh, long may it continue. Yeah, we wish you well, and you deserve it, sir. You deserve it. Thanks so much to Shepard and, of course, well done uh, to Corbus. As he says, we have uh, seen the horses. They certainly do look their part and don't look out of place, taking their place alongside some horses from uh, the bigger fields. Right, so that is that the bomb landed, if you are interested. 3.53% uh, of a pick six ticket goes into the last leg. If you caught the first jackpot, very well played to you, 19,000 plus. And if you are running in the second jackpot, you're just one of 161 people. That has been at this afternoon's racing. It is one more to come through race number seven. We look forward to your company then.